and Beatrice Schachter. We're in the same department. How are you? I'm Henrietta Pasterfield. Thanks. How'd you make out with the program list? Oh, I, I got through. I got through 16 of the 20. Then I've been here 16 years. Four years more, and I expect to have a perfect record. If I last. I've only had 12 this year. <laughs> I hate for me. As usual, the white kids don't trust me. Negro kids think I'm sold out to the whites. <laughs> I've managed 18. 11. Two and a half. I had planned a little talk on first impressions. And from that, I would make a good case for uh, uh, diction, uh, correct usage, and self-expression. And from that, it would just be one step to the limitless realm of creativity. And then to communication between student and teacher. And finally, mutual respect and even love. I like the part about limitless realm. Kid them along. Make it a game. I have a new one this year. Hospital spelling. The uh, misspelled words are the patients, and the kids are the doctors and the nurses. <laughs> Why aren't you eating your lunch? Well, oh, well, I just can't seem to face mashed potatoes at 10, 17 in the morning. In future, try Jell-O. It gives you energy, but it doesn't require an appetite. Ever tried punctuation sex, Henrietta? Hyphens are kisses, commas are maybes, and a period is a definite no. And then, of course, there's the uh, limitless realm of semicolons and apostrophes. I shudder to think what an exclamation point might mean. I don't care. It keeps them off the streets, and you give them a bit of fun, and you've earned your keep. Have you met Paul Barringer? The glamour boy of the English department. Unpublished writer. Dangerous. You're on your own.